Trump went on to suggest that Sessions, who served as a Trump campaign advisor, would have quashed the probe. The Russian witch hunt hoax continues, all because Jeff Sessions didn't tell me he was going to recuse himself, Trump tweeted. I would have quickly picked someone else. So much time and money wasted, so many lives ruined and Sessions knew better than most that there was no collusion. In a striking relationship between a president and his own attorney general, Trump has repeatedly and publicly attacked his own attorney general. Trump could fire Sessions or Rosenstein, but he would potentially face an uphill battle to confirm their replacements in the U.S. Senate. According to the New York Times, Trump berated Sessions during a meeting at the president's Mar-a-Lago resort that month, and asked his attorney general to retain control of Mueller's investigation, telling Sessions he should reverse his decision to recuse himself. Sessions did not. Last July, Trump publicly accused Sessions of taking a very weak position on investigating his 2016 rival, Hillary Clinton. Trump also described his attorney general as beleaguered. In February, the president ripped Sessions for asking the inspector general to investigate allegations of misconduct in FBI Director James Comey's handling of surveillance of former Trump adviser Carter Page. Earlier Tuesday, Trump wondered aloud why the Inspector General's investigation is taking so long. What is taking so long with the Inspector General's report on crooked Hillary and slippery James Comey, the president tweeted. Numerous delays. Hope report is not being changed and made weaker. There are so many horrible things to tell, the public has the right to know. Transparency. Meanwhile, Mueller continues investigate the Trump campaign's contacts with Russia and the president's possible obstruction of justice. On Monday, Trump tweeted that he has the absolute right to pardon himself. White House Press Secretary Sarah Sanders on Monday sidestepped questions from reporters about Trump's assertion, arguing that he wouldn't need to because the president hasn't done anything wrong. She then went on to repeat that refrain nine times over a 15-minute span.